Hi, my name's Jean. This is a job adorned by JD. That's the name of my company. Uh, I specialise in African inspired accessories, i.e., handbags, shoes, clothing. Some of my things are handmade, so they're one off, they're unique. Uh, one of my specialities is the African print sliders, which are all unique, handmade. Uh, this wonderful event was actually the launch of my career as a, a black entrepreneur, and I found it very, very useful and helpful in getting my product out there and people being able to appreciate what I sell and what I make and do. Uh, so yeah, that's, uh, that's me. Hello everyone, uh, my name is Bianca and this is my business called Hand of Gaia. Um, Hand of Gaia um, is an African inspired um, homeware and babywear brand. Um, we use all organic cotton and fair trade um, cotton as well. Um, the products I'm selling here today at the Black History Studies Black Market and Film Festival, my first time here. So our best seller is our 100% organic cotton bodysuit. So these are all my original hand-drawn designs um, and again African inspired. So we have sizes going from 0 to 3 right up until 18 to 24 months. We also have another design which is the Water Renews and this one was actually inspired by my daughter. Um, my daughter's name is Gaia. Hand of Gaia is about, it means Mother Earth and it means Mother Earth nourishes and guides you towards your destiny. So we're very much about African spirituality and um, the cosmology from the African perspective. We also have these organic um, cotton tea towels. So this is the Roots Culture Medicine tea towel. And this one is about uh, the root vegetables taken from the Caribbean to inspire the traditional um, Caribbean Saturday soup. So you've got the yam, you've got sweet potatoes, you've got taro, but then you also have the beetroot and turnip as well. So this is kind of like the British infusion where my grandma came here and she would make the Saturday soup with these kind of additions as well. So you have so that's honouring and kind of representing our culture. And then I also have another tea towel in the blue. This one is incredibly popular. Um, and this one is honouring my all the women in my family. So I have the star seeds. So it's inspired by the Dogon uh, people of Mali um, and the way that they look at the cosmos. So you've got the star seed, my grandmother, my mother, myself, and then also my daughter. And this is representing the wisdom and they're always teaching me. And um, yes, yeah, so this is the first time I've been here. I've really enjoyed the day. It's been very, very good. And uh, yeah, I hope to come and participate um, at the next event. Yeah. My name is Skondi and I'm the founder and CEO of Africa's Art. We are a new website which we are setting up to sell African art um, to display some of the beautiful works um, that are there in Africa. As you can see here we have a selection of pieces which have been sourced from South Africa, painted by artists from various countries from South Africa to Senegal and also Tanzania. We also have a selection of paintings as well which are also from Ghana. We we have some bags, some lovely handmade African bags as well. These are hand stitched in South Africa. And we also do rucksacks as well. Um, so we're at the Black History Studies event at the Black Market today on the 1st of September 2018. It's been a great day, lots of lovely people that we've met, we've sold bags, we've sold paintings, lots of interest. Um, if you'd like to follow us, please follow us on our social media, which are Instagram, Twitter and Facebook. And our tag is Africa Has Art, A-F-R-I-C-A-H-A-S-A-R-T. Thank you.
This is Kitty Lots Hair Care and I'm here at the Black Market which is organised by Black History Studies. It's a fantastic e um, event, it's about black economics, so it's organised by black people for black people. It's about the black pound and keeping that circulating in our community. So today what I have is my travel packs. So in here you get every product is a hundred meals. So you get your shampoo and your conditioner and you also get either a hair mist or relaxed and natural hair oil. This has been selling pretty well today. Obviously everybody's going on holiday. And another favourite is the leave-in conditioner. So today we have lemongrass or we have lavender and geranium. It's non-residue, so it can be left in and leaves the hair supple and moist with a nice smell. And it's also got organic broccoli seed oil in, so that's another very good seller. I have quite a few regular customers who've come today. And this is another good one, the Rosemary and Lavender Herbal Shampoo. Made with fresh herbs, it's got a lovely earthy smell. And it's very good for dry, itchy, flaky scalp for eczema or psoriasis, very very good indeed. As you know, rosemary is stimulating, so it's good for growth. This is actually my favourite. It's an acquired smell. It's birch and horsetail herbal shampoo. Very, very earthy, very, very strong and powerful. Some people have said to me it smells like something from their childhood, something that their mum used to put on their hair, and it's actually my favourite. It's been shown to increase the hairs on your head by 30%. We've also got some lovely hair mists. If, like me, you go to the gym but don't want to shampoo your hair in five minutes, we've got the lavender and peppermint, very, very nice and refreshing. Also the lemongrass one, and we've also got the rosemary and peppermint. So, it's been a wonderful event as usual. It always is when I come here. I love coming here. I'm part of the furniture. I'm always here. And people know this is where they can find me. Another kind of new addition are these silk sleep bonnets, which a lot of people are buying today. I've had to demonstrate it and actually put it on my head for a few people to buy. Some guys are buying it in the twos. They like it so much. And finally, the final kind of product on special today is this little try me pack. So if you're not sure and you don't want to buy the full size products, you can actually buy 100ml shampoo and conditioner. They make great gifts for the Christmas and they also make really good gifts to try and see what you think about them. So thank you Charmaine and Mark for allowing me yet again to be here. It's been a fantastic event as usual educational as well as the entertainment and the food and seeing my fellow stallholders it's been wonderful so thank you very much see you next time <laughs>
Um, it's about um, a community of um, young entrepreneurs that, um, and, it's, and it's teaching them group economics and it's about um, a group of um, young business people that um, support each other and um, kind of help each other in their businesses basically. So with the book I'm trying to um, plant the seed into like, like young children's minds that you know that they can first one first of all um, have their own business and two once they do have their own business that they um, support each other um, people that look like them, people of colour and um, yeah and just um, keep the money circulating in the community and it builds up the community so that's the, the main idea of the book, um, Good Economics for Young People.